Are you getting the error message, file too large, when you try to put files on your USB drive? This is quite a common problem, and I'm going to show you how to fix it. This is Dave's Tech Rescue, where I solve your problems with computers, internet and technology. If you have a question you'd like to ask me, leave it in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer it. And remember to subscribe so you don't miss my next video where I might be answering your question. Today's question, I'm trying to copy some files onto a memory stick. It gets halfway, then says file too large. The file is too large for the destination file system. But there's plenty of space on the memory stick, what's happening? Well, if you're seeing this error, then your USB drive is probably using something called FAT32, and we can change this. When you buy a memory stick or a hard drive, it's prepared with something called a file system, and there are different file systems for different purposes. For example, some work really well on Windows computers, while others only work on Macs. If you're getting the file too large error, then your drive is probably using the FAT32 file system. A few years ago, most memory sticks and hard drives were sold with FAT32, because you could guarantee they would work everywhere, whether it was a Windows computer, a Mac, or a device like a TV. The problem with FAT32 is you can't store any files larger than about 4GB. If you try to store something big, like a movie file or your Outlook archive, then you get stuck. Fortunately, there's a simple solution. A newer file system called XFAT lets you store files of any size, and it works on pretty much any computer or media player. Your computer lets you erase your drive, so you can start again with a new file system. This is called formatting the drive. Let's find out how to format your drive with XFAT so you won't see the file too large notice again. First, it's really important to be aware that you'll be wiping your drive, so don't format it until you've copied your important data somewhere else. My USB stick already has a load of files saved onto it, so I'm going to make a folder on my computer and copy all the USB files onto it. Once all your USB files are copied somewhere safe, it's safe to format the drive. To do this, open your file explorer, then click on this PC. You'll see a list of all the drives on your computer, including your memory stick. You need to work out which one is the memory stick you want to format. It's crucial that you get this right, because you don't want to erase the wrong drive. Right click on the drive, and then click format. Don't worry about all these options, the important thing is that you look for file system and change it to XFAT. If you want to change the name that's displayed on your drive, you can type in a new name where it says volume label. You should leave quick format ticked, otherwise you're in for a really long wait. When you're certain that you want to erase the drive, click start, then press OK on this message. Now you just need to wait a few seconds while the drive is formatted. Then you can click OK and close this box and the drive is ready to use. You can try copying your files onto it again and this time hopefully you won't get any errors. Please let me know in the comments below how you got on and if this video helped you please give it the thumbs up. If you'd like to see more tutorials like this from me in future click on my face below and hit the red subscribe button. And while you're here why not check out one of my other videos like how to back up your stuff in Windows 10. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.